Uh, I, I'll be honest with you. We've been seeing some weird things with people staying home. And one of those things that I've noticed uh, both on social media and with some of our viewers emailing us photos at WCCO.com is the animals have taken back their kingdom. Uh, this was a picture that I saw on Twitter taken by Mary in Northeast Minneapolis. Northeast Minneapolis, believe it or not, actually known for having turkeys that roam. But uh, we too in downtown Minneapolis, just outside our CCO studio window a couple of days ago, saw this. That is a very brave turkey. Uh, thanks to our 10 p.m. producer, Leah, for sending uh, that to me. And then Carol in St. Paul on Harriet Island saw the work of some very busy beavers yesterday. That tree looks pretty close to coming down, given uh, all the animal activity that's been going on around it. Love seeing pictures like this. We have to just laugh sometimes to relieve some of the stress. And we appreciate when you give us the opportunity to do that. Notice, too, how gray and kind of misty it was yesterday. Today, a big improvement. Uh, northern Minnesota and central Minnesota in particular, where skies have been clearest with a fair amount of sunshine. Here in the Twin Cities, we've seen varying amounts of cloud cover and varying thicknesses to that cloud cover. We'll keep seeing that, I think, through the day today. And then in southern Minnesota, where we've had some rain showers uh, roaming around I-90 the past several hours, clouds have been a little bit thicker. But things are drying out there right now. Weather Watcher Network showing us a, a wide range in temperatures from 34 in Chicago and 35 in Alexandria. Those are the cool pockets to mid 40s in Faribault, Anoka, Lake City, New Ulm at 42, Rochester 41, Schaefer also and Cohasset too at 42 degrees, 40 in Avon, 41 in Park Rapids, 39 in Otter Tail. Looks like the brightest skies will be in central Minnesota through the day today. But again, we'll hold on to at least some sun locally. We'll stay dry in the metro, but southern Minnesota, while we'll see a drying trend in the short term, we'll see showers redevelop, especially from about the Minnesota River Valley on south down toward the Iowa border coming up late this afternoon into the evening. Then those fall apart overnight tonight. We'll get a little bit of clearing and tomorrow looks mostly cloudy, but we will see some peaks of sunshine. Looks generally quiet then the next couple of days. High today, upper 40s with a little more sun than we were originally thinking. A little cooler in southwestern Minnesota as those clouds stay thicker and that shower chance comes in. Again, central and northern Minnesota above average with highs 40 to 45 there. It will be chilly there tonight, but this is easy to handle given just within the past week we've had lows close to zero up there. Near 20 is not bad for Bemidji to Grand Rapids. 30 in St. Cloud, 32 in Wilmer, Twin Cities about 39, so a mild start to your Friday. And we'll just keep climbing. Mostly cloudy, 53, St. Cloud 54, Hinkley, Hayward 54, all looking pretty mild. Looks like by Saturday, though, we turn damp and raw with a pretty strong wind. Notice this east to northeast wind, 15 to 20 miles an hour. Wind driven rain with the potential coming up late morning through the afternoon, even for some rumbles of thunder, believe it or not. And then as we go through Saturday evening into Sunday, enough cold air wraps in on the backside to give us maybe some wet snow to wrap that storm up. It's going to be in the upper 30s, though, so it will not accumulate here in the Twin Cities. There may be some light accumulation along I-35 on north and east, but Sunday it melts away because we'll see increasing sun. High near 50 here, near 60 Monday, and hovering in the 50s to near 60 into next week, Liz. Uh, maybe a bigger storm coming up on Thursday next week, but again, aside from Saturday into Sunday morning, the next seven days will be dry. Enjoy. Okay. Yeah, and the payoff comes next week. We'll look for more uh, animal photos when the weather warms up. Look out. Okay. Who knows? Okay. Thank you, Mike.